Hello and welcome back to our Civilization Beyond Earth series. I am your host, Intrep Gamer, and as always, we start off with our excerpt. On Earth, the Pan Asian Cooperative was great. Out here, we will be better. With the new challenges, will come new ways to apply ourselves. We will find our niche and we will succeed. Nothing will stand in our way, and I will be at the forefront, leading us to greatness. So, not a much is happening. I have important information for oh no, a covert agent belonging to Brasilia has been killed in Tiangong. Alright, diplomacy. And let's see, who was that? The Brazilian. Bienvenido. Discuss. Follow this. Uh, actually, who was it? It was, oh, Brazil, yeah, Kobe's blind to Brasilia has been killed in, and Brasilia is this one, right? Brasilia, Brasilia, yeah, this, this is this guy. Oh, okay, oh, last turn. Okay, that's what happened. Last turn I confronted them about that. Okay, my bad. My B, guys. So, uh, nothing really much to see here. I think we'll pause this very soon, but... Uh, I am willing to overlook this indiscretion for now. Yeah, that's right. Stupid. Okay, so, wow, America is just, well, not America, but the uh, ARC is getting a little close to our territory, so, a person in the last turn we did, last episode, we talked to them about it, but uh, there's nothing really much to be done now, because we probably should have been a little bit houndoogity about that shit earlier, but, in the meantime, I think all we can do is get one more spot here, and kind of, you know, do the best we can. But, uh, all these possibilities, yo. All these possibilities. You should get over here. And then start building a road from here to here. Because, uh, that's a thing. Yeah. Coal. And, yeah. Gotta start building up, get as much stuff as we can. I think. Of course, we will open borders with you. There you go. And things are going fine and dandy. Mainly because we just got the right infrastructure. Ooh, route to cancelled. Okay, well, you can start doing... Oops, damn it. Okay, get over here. That was bad. That was bad. Did not meant for that one to start, you know, being automated, but... Meant this one to be automated, not this one. But, too late, too late, that's fine. We'll just start working up on the road from here to here. And I think everything is fine and dandy. Ooh, alien nest. Hey, cool. Okay, we got production going. We want to build a clinic for sure here. And over here, definitely want to build another clinic. Unit needs to be told what to do, so we will establish a trade route with this guy. Ooh. Nope. Don't want to renew, just want you to go for a little bit. Alright. And you, as well, should go to here to get it rolling as quick as we can. Where does this alien nest discovered? Right there, right there. Okay, okay. We got some marines here, so we'll move over and decimate that thing. Decisive victory. Boom. There you go. Got some gold. Got rid of some of these aliens. It's just, you know, gotta stay out of potential territory. And 
start building a road. Boom. And not because that uh, we need a road for trade, but also so that we can quickly move units around if we ever go to war. That's the main reason why I'm building all these roads to connect my cities to each other. The only one that's not working so far is because of this, but because of this alien menace over here, which I think we should probably start wiping out right now. Connection established. That's cool. And that turn. Yeah. Ooh, what's that? Alien skeleton. Cool. So yeah, definitely probably want to build one more city and just drop it like right here, I think. You know, because uh, because we can, and because we want to grab as much territory as we can. Although the one thing that's kind of sucking right now is the health penalties we have, but there's only so much you can do, and so much the better, I say. So yeah, uh, almost done with this road here, which would be good. We get Krigia. To connect with the rest of everyone else. And we have new production. Excellent. So that means we need to get a pharmaceutical rolling. Get as much of these negative penalties as we can out. Alright, let's see. Go. Shoot. Excellent. And that turn. Infrastructure is definitely key to any good civilization. With a good infrastructure, we can get things moved around quickly and help move units around just as fast. All right, let's see. Uh, heal up a bit. Just want to be safe so we can wipe these guys out as quick as we can next turn. And nanotechnology is getting done. Nanopasters definitely will be useful. But yeah. Alien that's discovered. Oh wow. That's definitely going to pick that one up because we can. Take you out. Boom. Wiped out. And hopefully can take out this next bit of alien menace. So yeah. Everything's looking solid. Nothing much really to talk about I think. But. We will stick around for a little bit to take out this conclusion of this little skirmish with the aliens. Yeah they're attacking us. Definitely we can wipe them out next turn then. Pardon me, I may be able to assist you. Fine. That's cool, we already know that. And I think, yeah, we'll pause it here. And see where things will lead us in a few turns. So I will check with you guys in a second. Hey guys, welcome back. Alright, we got a quest decision. Strange... How humanity now lives on an alien planet, yet still struggles to reclaim many of its past technological achievements. Having now regained network capabilities, we move one step closer to a completely unknown future. The shape of that future will be determined by how we utilize our current technologies. For example, the network links all our systems and allows us to disseminate our knowledge digitally, be it technological or cultural. Which of these is more beneficial? We do not know. So, free maintenance for networks or from culture? I think culture from network. We shall give the network over to the people. As citizens of humanity, it is their birthright. Through it, their voices and opinions shall be heard across the planet. Let us hope they use it wisely. Well, that happened. So, yeah. So, while we were gone... I thought we were gaining some good, you know, friendliness, and then the ARC were like, 
condemning us. And I'm like, what the heck's going on right now? We're just we're trying to be buddy buddies, yo. But, you know, hopefully they're not trying to go to war with us. Because they, they are. I'm really, really out of position for that. And, uh, yeah, you know. Ooh, hopefully nothing too crazy comes out of that. So, yeah, I mean, other than that, I think, you know, we got to do with what we can. Uh, let's put that into R&D. Get us some... Actually, let's get this guy over here just in case. So, I think this is probably the three closest cities. That will be... From any attack that um, the ARC launches against us. Now this armor around which is not so hot for me. But hopefully uh, things will look up and we don't actually go to outright war with them. So let's build that. Build roads. I don't know where this guy's going. Because I don't see why they can't just build a road from here. But maybe they're building a road from here, so it'll go this way for whatever reason. But, um, I think that'll be it, and I think we'll pause it again to see uh, what happens in a few turns. So I'll see you guys in a second. Well, guys, we're at war. The world is at war. This is no bueno, guys. Probably should have done something, but... Now we are in the cast. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. Well, I've chosen a virtue. Want to get that standardized. That would be good for us. So, connects in the city is broken. Intruders. So, let's see. Okay, so let's see what the damage. We are at war with these guys. War with these guys. We have these two friendly allies. And this guy that should help. Offset some of this. This guy is at neutral right now. These two are neutral. Let's see. Discuss. Uh, deal. Can't really do anything. So we're stuck in a bit of a bind. So I think for this, we should go for. Our capital. Uh, yeah. Actually, let's go for this. And you shall go to that. And you. Should continue uh, Let's try to keep friendly with the Frenchies And you I guess will Yeah, okay, let's go for... Let's go for this guy. And a union needs orders. Put the hurt on those guys. Let's build some... We got some money. So let's purchase some tack jets. Let's see. Carrier, gunboats, tack jets. Uh, overall combat provides. Let's do that. 
and a yeah actually let's, let's buy two tag jets here and purchase a tag net hub and I think actually we'll end it right here because this is probably going to be a really good start to a next episode the world at war so stay tuned for that I just got like wow this thing just totally went high and right and I mean things are happening now and this is just gonna get insane so yeah guys stick around to see if I can survive a world at war this is Intrap Gainer signing off and I'll see you guys next time Laters.